We talked about this whole experience uh, with all the expectations placed on this team this year. What is it like to go into this year with such high expectations? Um, it's a lot different from uh, last year. Um, just being an underdog, having to uh, prove each game in the tournament when um, you expect it to uh, not um, come up with the win. Uh, just this year, it being um, us being the top um, now, it's just a lot different. But uh, the way uh, we've been working in practice and just how hard we've been going and everyone being so focused has made uh, a lot of the pressure go away. Yeah. What was last night like? Uh, it was 40 minutes of us playing basketball with no subs. So <laughs> <laughs> it was tough. But, uh, nah, it was really just pretty much us having practice just in front of thousands of rub I felt. And, like, everyone just felt comfortable just with how much chemistry we already had with the players we were playing with. It was just fun. Callan seemed real excited about the defense. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, a lot of guys uh, retired, really, so playing for you is just tough on anybody. So, Terrence, when, uh, when Cal says a light bulb has gone on for Terrence, what does he mean? Um, really, it just means uh, I know what type of player I want to be. You know, I, know, I just want to lead by being able to lead by example. Uh, be focused every day in practice and give uh, the players to have someone they can look up to and just watch. Cal said the other day that he didn't know if there's a better player in the country than yourself. Has he told you that? Do you believe that? Uh, well, it's a great compliment coming from a uh, coach that I know has coached a lot of great players. So I just want to keep him saying that. That's what he's saying. you watched yourself last year going back after the years so you, you look at some of the stuff you did in tape or not. What did you see from yourself as a player and maybe what did, what's different now? Uh, I just really wanted to work on uh, getting stronger, you know, being able to get faster, you know, my ball handling, my shot, my shot. I just wanted to become a better all around player. I just wanted to Talk about those freshmen coming in a little bit. You played as a true freshman last year. What advice have you been able to give these guys who come in right away? Uh, well, really, these guys just came in really focused. You know, they just really been getting after it. It's just made a lot of, uh, of things easier. But playing so competitive practice is just going to help us in the long run. I don't think it's going to be in a, a lot of guys that. Terrence, I like the guys who play practice. Terrence, what's the difference between this group of freshmen coming in this year and your class coming in last year? Uh, I feel uh, they got a lot more size than we did. And, uh, just the way Ant Anthony blocks shots and uh, how Kyle can stretch out uh, the defense and bring big men out to paint by how well he shoots the ball. And uh, Marcus being able to just read defense and him being one of the best ball handlers I ever played with, and just how fast he is, it's just really great to have. Uh, Mike just being a hustle player and doing all the little things to uh, try to get wins. What are your workouts like this summer? I mean, obviously you've changed your body. Take us through maybe what your workouts are like or what the stretch for and how you changed over the years. Yeah, uh, really just being serious every time I stepped on the court, every trail, just being focused and just working out. Um, every little thing, as hard as I could, began to shoot in my ball handling and the play room and um, just getting faster. It's competition. Um, what I've learned from last year is uh, we got to respect every person we play, especially if it's an away game. So uh, I'm going to respect them every uh, two days this year. You think they're, they're ranking? We had a tough time with them last year. We beat them once, they beat us once, so I respect them.
jokes the other day about you and Devon when uh, you would fight over who was the last person in the gym before practice and all that stuff. How has your, how's your attitude changed? And even Devon has changed about practice and you know, doing the things necessary, maybe unnecessary to you in, in some respect. How has your attitude changed towards that uh, this year? Well, um, really, I say it's just um, came with the less mature and just getting older. Not being a little freshman kids to play around in practice or come in slow because they don't feel like practicing. Just really taking our games to another level by just trying to get better in every drill and every practice. Is that tr literally true, Terrence, that you and Duran used to, would be outside? No. <laughs> <laughs> when did that light bulb go off? I mean, when did you realize that, hey, that's where you're really going to get a lot better? That's where you can not so much in the games necessarily. Well, for me, uh, coming back, I, I took that choice myself to say I'm going to be uh, one of the hardest workers on the team and uh, try to just lead by example and uh, be focused in every practice. Terrence, you talked about coming back. How much did the lockout have the role when you back? Uh, they had a lot, really. Um, I didn't really want to jump into a situation that um, started having problems. And, um, I just had a lot more confidence about coming back with the guys that were uh, coming in and the guys that did come back to try to set a goal for the national championship. What, what should we, you had 52 last night, I guess, 52 points. What should we make of that? I didn't see the game. What, what, what does that say? What, what should we think about that? Bad defense. <laughs> uh, nah, it was uh, just us playing against each other, so I mean, it wasn't really anything too much to take from it. It doesn't say something about your improvement in any way, or uh, more versatility, or, or anything? Uh, yeah, I've improved, and I feel I've gotten a lot better. We still got a long season to show for it, so that's what I want to show. Terrence, where do you think he's improved the most if you go back to um, I would say just being physical on my drives, um, both ways, and just uh, playing with more confidence. You've, never, you've said it's not a big deal. We've talked about it before. That a cow got on you so much and so publicly last year. Has he treated you any differently this year? Has he approached you, handled you differently in early, early on in practices than he did throughout last year? Well, I feel he doesn't have to say uh, too much to me as much as he did last year. He doesn't, he's not really teaching me anything new right now when it comes to us learning and plays and it's the same stuff. And I'm just trying to go harder. So. How do you think the Terrence Jones of now would do against the Terrence Jones of coming into his freshman year? A lot better. I would kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> what would you do to that guy? How, how could you take advantage of him? Really, I feel um, you can't force me uh, one way this year mm -hmm. compared to what teams were doing last year. Right. Uh, Making you go right? Yeah. And, uh, I just feel I'm playing with a lot more confidence when it comes to driving both ways and taking bumps, uh, driving physically. Were you as aware of that 